Hi guys, it's me. And today, looks like I'll be reviewing the good old GP7 gas mask, as you can see right here. Now, as you can see right here, it's an old antique brown bag with the left and right pouches on the side. Very smooth, feels like whoa. Details, not so great. This is the GP7 itself. It's it's made of uh, latex. Very feels very rubbery. And as you can see on the inside, it's just two eye holes. If you open up even more, you can see the two nose holes here that I to breathe in and out through. And you can see this is where you inhale, and that's where you exhale. And here's the filter. It's green, lightly tinted. And also, make sure to take off the top cap and the bottom cap so you don't accidentally suffocate yourself. And sometimes don't breathe it in depending on the date because it may have asbestos in it. But it's very uncolored um, from the mask. I don't know what was the point of having a different color from the mask. But I'll show you the date on it right here. There you go. Just get a good look at it. Now that's really it in my empty bag of tricks right here as you can see. Now let's put it away and check the left and right pouches. As you can see here I have what's on the right side. I have medical tape and hand sanitizer which you guys should really use. Now these are my bandages that um, I use, well, not per se use, and they're really used for nothing as you can now as you can see here, I'm wearing the gas mask and I'm going to try to put on the filter with my neck and back of my head. Now number one, I didn't inhale this, I held my breath while doing this. And it was very fun trying to keep myself from choking to death. Now this is everything I have in my GP7 bag. Now sadly I couldn't afford the one that comes with the tube that's supposed to connect into the bag. Because you know, I ain't got that much money, but still. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.